what's up guys welcome back to my channel and today i am going to be doing an updated review on the um king rosa queen hair hopefully i said that right if i didn't say that right i'll probably put the correct name on the screen but the last time i remember i think is king rosa queen hair um so this is how the box looked like and inside the last video i showed you guys that it came with flexi rods and a hair cap whatever so this is the hair and the hair oh my goodness guys it is still very unbelievably like soft and like i'm looking at myself in the rear mirror like the little mirror thing right here and it's still really soft like it's amazing but the one problem still having with this hair is that it's super duper thin so if you're thinking about getting this hair and you do not like thin hair this hair is not for you but you know it's easy to put on i did not pluck the edges this is a lace front and if you if i lift this thing up you will see like yeah it's not looking too good underneath but the thing about it is is i only wear it like in the middle part but if you're going to plan on wearing it up and stuff, then you can definitely finesse like your edges and all that jazz. So, does this hair have tangling? Yes, it's a wig, so it tangled just a little bit in the back. It did tangle, but that's because like I throw around my wigs everywhere. I do not take care of my wigs. I do not baby my wigs. So it did nap up a little bit in the back, but nothing like it couldn't really brush out. I have an elastic band in this hair, like ear tabs to ear tabs, so I'm not wearing any glue or any like got to be glued or any go spawn on my hair. This is just it. I did um, lay down my edges a little bit for you guys with some, um, with some, oh, I have it right here, with some of this. This is an edge control. I know some people say not to use edge controls on your lace wig, but to be honest, do whatever you want. <laughs> so yeah, this is the updated hair review. The hair is doing really great. Um, I like it. I think it's good. I mean, King Rosa Queen, whatever your name is, you're doing pretty well. And the shedding of this hair is very like minimal. Like I don't even think I've ever seen shedding. The only time I've seen shedding of this hair was when I plucked my middle part. That's the only thing I plucked. I didn't pluck anything else, just the middle of my hair. That's it. Didn't bleach my knots. The hair was too thin. I wasn't really gonna like keep plucking it because I wanted all the all the hair I can possibly keep. So all I did was pluck my middle part. And yeah, so this is the box it came with. And um would I recommend this to a friend? Definitely. I know some YouTubers come on here and they tell you guys the hair is great and the hair is amazing and like it's like end all be all. But yeah, I wasn't going to do that, so <laughs> the hair is really good, but it does have its pro cons, like for example, it's really thin, but it's really beautiful hair. If you like short hair, if you like light hair, if you like soft hair, if you like manageable straight hair, then you're definitely going to love this hair. But if you don't like short hair, if you don't like thin hair, if you don't like, it's thin to the part where it looks natural, but at the same time it's like... Sometimes people just want to feel like something is on their head. And this, with this wig, you really don't even feel like something is on your head because it's like that thin and it's really light and fluffy. It could be a good thing or a bad thing depending on what you like. So yeah. So this is how I usually wear the hair. I know in the last video I wore the hair um, like in its wavy state, whatever. I don't wear the hair like that anymore. I only strain the hair. Sometimes I do curl the hair once in a blue moon whenever I'm not lazy <laughs> but yeah so this is how the hair basically always looks on me except I did my edges I tried to do my edges today because I was like oh I'm gonna film <laughs> let me do my edges but usually I don't even have my edges I just literally slap them on <laughs> slap it on and slap it off I love how carefree wigs are and yeah so um if you didn't watch my last video this hair is from King Rosa Queen hopefully I made that right on AliExpress and my inches are 10 inches I have 10 inches like the level cut is 10 inches I got this hair in a 1B this hair cost $68 I looked back on um, AliExpress to this hair again and it looks like the price has went up I don't know why but it has gone up so I think it's worth the increase of what price I don't know 
it's pretty good hair so I guess it's a good hair to throw on and throw off in between your wigs your weaves or anything like that because it's very easily and manageable but yeah this hair came with flexi rods and I already said that right <laughs> I'm repeating myself I don't know what to say I'm gonna show you guys this hair curled because I usually also wear it curled so if you guys want to see it curled that's exactly what i'm gonna do stay tuned for my next video because i'm going to be doing a review on is it lavi hair rebecca is it lavi hair no yeah. it's um nadula oh i'm gonna be doing a review on nadula hair the curly nadula hair i never heard about them before but apparently my sister has and she has made a wig for me so i'm like so excited to review it for you guys so and um yeah let me show you guys different ways to wear this hair if you like this hair because I know some people like straight down and some people like curly so I'm gonna show you guys this hair curly stay tuned guys so I'm going to be using this wand this wand is from X to X Ava I can't read it's X T A V A I don't know this brand and I'm just gonna use it to curl my hair and show you guys the different style that I wear in it Usually when I curl my hair, I only curl the front because I am lazy. So if you're a lazy person like me, then you're going to be doing pretty well. This hair is good for lazy people. And I feel like I'm like saying so many good things about this hair, but I really wanted to find something terrible. The only thing terrible I find about this hair is that it's thin. That's really it. <laughs> and it's really bad. I want to find something terrible about the hair. Ooh, that is so cute, right? By the way, if you guys want to see my other wig review and you guys didn't see my initial wig review, I'm going to link it down below. Yep, so for the first of this video, I'm not curling this hair, like, dramatically, but I would usually wear it, like, I have it this side really nice and curled. And yeah, so these are the two styles that I usually wear this hair in. And as you can see, whether they're curly or straight, this hair would look great on anybody, really. If you like short hair, if you're into short hair, I love short hair. So thanks for watching my video. Do not forget to like and subscribe. Do not forget to comment down below because I want to know what you think about this hair. What you think about this video. What you think in general. What do you want to see me do next? Like I said, I'm doing a, another review on different hair so stay tuned for that and subscribe and put your bells up is that what you do put your post notification bell on yeah <laughs> see I'm, I'm getting used to this YouTube thing put your post notification bell on and yeah so if you guys want to see more of me then you guys you guys could do that cuz you know I'm kinda cute maybe <laughs>